Hello there, dear viewers. Today, we are going to be interviewing the Roman Emperor Nero. We're going to see if he was really a bad person, if he was maybe semi-good. We're going to see every twist and turn, everything. We're going to find out if it's true, and we're going to interview him today. So thank you very much. Thank you for listening. Welcome to To Catch an Emperor. Who are you? Get me out of this gabio. <laughs> By gabio, he means prison. I'm here right now, aren't I? I have a few questions for you, Nero. Get me out of here first, you fool! <laughs> no, I would feel greatly unsafe. Unsafe? I'll show you unsafe when I slit your throat. My point exactly. Now, did you kill your mom? Oh, yes. Yes, I did do that. Why? My mother, Agrippina, was trying to control me, and I do not take well to people trying to use my power for their personal needs. Is it true you and Agrippina often had an incestuous relationship? She controlled me to the point where I could not take it anymore. That is all I shall say. Understood. Next question. Did you kill your wife? Wife? Singular? Buddy, I killed two of my wives. <laughs> and those are just the ones you know about. <laughs> 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 and one of them was pregnant. <laughs> That's horrifying. What did you say? Nothing, nothing. What? Now, how did you restructure Rome? Well, I killed my way to the throne a little bit, but people often overlook my tax and currency reforms. They, they were pretty well liked by the citizens of Rome, and... They really appreciated them. It's just my enemies that made them look bad. Yes, yes, yes. He's not a completely bad person. He's not. He's not. He's good. He has a semblance of good. He has a little good. Bad person? Me? You're pretty despised in history. What? Why? Most of your policies, murder, the fact that you kind of built a palace right after Rome entirely burned, and also murder, and just a, just a lot of that stuff. Like, it was pretty messed. I took advantage of the opportunity. You kind of left your city in the mud. I helped rebuild it. Yeah, in your own self-image. I did what was best for the people. By playing the fiddle as Rome fell? What? You played the fiddle as Rome burned. No. No, who would play the fiddle as Rome burned? I was out of town. Really? Because, like, most people, if you were to, like, say, like, oh, what's something Nero did, they'd be like, oh, he played the fiddle as Rome burned. I did not. That is a myth. Got it. Can we talk about Sporus for a second? Oh, yes, yeah, Sporus. Sporus. He was the little boy I turned into my wife who killed himself because I was going to assault him in front of everyone in the Colosseum. Yeah. Did you regret how you treated him? You're acting like I treated him wrong. Oh, my God, you are not a good person. I have always done what has had to be done. Even murder. Even murder. Even murder, yes, yes. Sometimes you have to restructure something in a way where it only benefits you. Like murder? When are you gonna... Wh wh when are you gonna understand this? Murder isn't the best option most of the time, but, like, if you're the emperor and you have the power to kill people like that, why not? Like with your mom. She manipulated me into an incestuous relationship. She used me, and I did what had to be done. I apologize. I apologize. I'm sorry. I only restructured out of what I viewed as right. I apologize. I'm sorry. I, I apologize. It's okay. I'm just gonna have to kill you. What? <laughs> 